welcome back. We're going to play some more games on Chevy Horse. Uh, we've been playing in the 10 minute category lately. Let's play a few more here, although I do intend to switch it up and start playing the 10 second category sometime soon. But let's stick to this 10 minute format for just a little longer. Hopefully I'm awake enough to play. We'll see. Last few times I've been playing, I've been playing the same opening, and it's been really sharp. And I think if I just play really alertly, I can play well. Good luck. It is true that I tend to slightly vary what I'm doing, so... Um, if our opponent's trying to hit our bishop's head, I don't know if I should have played this one move faster. Um, yeah, a couple games ago, I did allow the opponent to use this file under different circumstances. Do I want to play this here directly or play there? I'm not sure. I think here today. Just given the move order we took to get here and how my king's still in the center. Um, I think this is fine. Okay. Yep, there's the knight move as expected. Let's drop the rook back. Good morning. You may be able to hear my alarm clock in the background. I will eventually get to silencing it. Um, yeah, one second. So yeah, yesterday I had taken a closer look at that Jen Nyrock game, and it was really surprising to me uh, just how important it is to build a castle. Even being one or two moves away from having your king somewhere safe can make an enormous difference. Um, this is puzzling to me. This is deeply puzzling to me. I don't get it. I will capture this knight. So this is yeah, the high speed silver 3-7 variation. Fair enough, but um something doesn't look quite right. Okay, maybe this should have been played earlier. Um But what do I do about it now? I think I take this here. Uh, 
So, yeah, our proverb of the day is the dragon to the enemy camp, the horse to your own. Uh, here are silvers flying way up there, but um, it's fine. Oh, this is their point, is they want to use their silver. Um, I'm not sure that works the way they think it does. Nanafun. So, if I promote, this rook advances up here somewhere. If I don't promote, that's interesting. Oh, hang on. There is a reasonable way to play this. And it does not seem to require my rook to stay here. Oh, but then they get a pawn in hand and they can drop it and eventually build up an attack. So whose attack is faster? Also, I could just drop a knight and threaten this. Either way, they're going to block their bishop. Um... Hmm. Oh, I could hit the rook so many ways here, can't I? Um, I'm so confused. Gofun. Okay, well, I'm just going to make a guess here. I'm having difficulty reading, and sitting here is not making the reading any easier. So, that's my guess. And if they take my pawn, my rook goes over and hits this weak point, and I don't know what happens next. Actually, if they take the pawn, I can just take back, can't I, with the either the rook or the bishop. Hmm. Probably with the rook. Well, no, they could drop a rook effect. Well, if they had a rook, it right now has one square, but I don't think it's super effective there. Plus my... Well, no, my bishop wouldn't be protecting, allowing me to play gold 5-1 here. So, yep, yeah, sorry, I'm a bit confused in my thoughts. Um, the silver is trapped, but I shouldn't continue chasing it. Really, my goal is this pawn here. I don't know how I'm ultimately going to get there, because, like, I'd seem to need a silver or a knight or something around here somewhere. But as soon as I start placing pieces, they start defending. And building a continuous attack is kind of difficult. I could drop the bishop back to support an attack, but again, like, breaking this pawn cover is something that just confuses me. I'm not sure how to break it. Um, I could promote this, but then their rook advances. 
I could drop a silver here, the rook goes somewhere else, I guess back here, and then my silver takes, and then, I mean, it, that builds an initiative. If I was a uh, promoted silver here and another silver right there, and I'm starting to exchange pieces, that's one way to attack. Um, but they're going to take the 5-5 five, five point if I'm careless. Okay, that seems to have, well, I thought that I had a straightforward answer, but silver drop here isn't so straightforward. Here is cleaner, um, but so much slower. This has a bad feeling, but I don't see any concrete variation refuting it. The bad feeling is because this is like such a slow attack. But again, I, yeah, this is confusing me. So now I can like bring up this silver, promote it promote the other silver, and eventually work my way over. None of that happens because they sacrifice. And such begins our attack. Maybe shouldn't have moved the rook. Maybe I'm just a bit trigger-happy here. Um... So I can still... Oh, I don't have a silver to drop anymore. Um, uh, gosh darn it. Hmm... Sampun. Okay, my attack begins. Let's defend my king against a knight drop, but also start bringing a silver toward their king. Ah. I mean, on the surface, that taking the lance looks reasonable. Uh, a possible problem is that I get to drop pieces near their king. I should have taken this gold, shouldn't I? No, they take my dragon. I take the other gold. Or, I don't know, I drop a gold and I don't know. <sighs> Again, trigger happy. I don't know why. But yeah, this is... I don't see how to continue my attack. This is bad. Okay, 
Okay, we'll try to rebuild a castle since I don't know what else to do here. Okay, this is loose, the one that taking this makes the silver loose. I guess they retreat their silver. Oh, but I'm threatening this as well. To which they might respond with a rook drop, but I'm okay with that. My own camp looks weak to a rook drop here. Uh, I'd be able to drop a pawn, and um, I'm not sure how I survived this. But yeah, lone gold defending a king is not a terrible castle. There are worse castles out there. Um, Ipun. Okay. I'm scared of their attack and I don't believe in my attack just yet. Um Now I have some belief in my attack, since I have lots of pieces. They'll drop another gold to defend. Why am I doing that for? Okay, thankfully they don't have a lance to defend with. Thanks for the game. Alright, let's play again. I'll study these games after the series is done. Good luck.
This seems like the timing that if I have anything, this is the right time to attack. I'm not certain that I have something, but if I do, and if I delay, uh, then that chance is lost. So here we go. Oh, wow. Um... All right, I don't know what to do. I just I just trapped my silver, didn't I? I guess we're not worried about that. Hmm. I am so bamboozled here. All right, let's find out where this leads. This has my curiosity.
5分。I thought I had another attacking piece. This is going to get very difficult. Um, Hmm. Three minutes. Wow, you seem to be getting all the spam bots this morning. I don't know what's up with that. But yeah, two in one morning. Who knew? Ah, that's clever. I've not seen that done before. That definitely delays me from getting additional. Well, yes, yeah, so that pulls me away from the castle for one turn. Although now I have another pawn in hand, but I mean, what can I do now? I needed that tempo. This pawn drop was too good. Um. That sucks <laughs> a lot. 
don't want this dragon to become active, so we consequently have to do some pretty weird looking moves here. Oh, they can take our pawn. They didn't. Um, Oh, that's hanging. All right. Um, I think we admit defeat here. Well played. Thanks for the game. All right, let's play another. Good luck. I'm guessing they're going to take back, but maybe they'll drop a bishop first. I'm not sure. One thing I've avoided is taking this pawn, which would leave me prone to the king rook fork. Um, but yeah, as it stands, I have three pawns in hand. If our opponent does nothing, I could protect this pawn with silver 5-3. Um, that is check, yes. Okay, so this is where they wanted their bishop to go. Um, Well, that makes sense. So here, after they take, they're threatening my knight. The most obvious way to defend my knight is directly, so let's attempt this. And this comes with its own attack. Oh. Interesting. That's really sharp. Um, I don't need to capture that immediately. 
Let's capture you first. If they take this pawn, then I take the horse. Uh, so they've not. Um, also interesting. It's very difficult. I, I can build up an attack here very quickly by taking the silver and then dropping it there and taking here. No, that has to be right. I can build an attack very quickly by taking this and promoting my bishop here as well. Is speed everything? Not always. Yeah, this has my interest. Uh, no, you're just in time to observe here. Welcome. I think they defend this with their rook. They actually don't. Um... So perhaps I got more than I should have gotten from the steel. Um, we've split their castle, but they do have a horse defending it. And they have a monster or a rook drop they're threatening on me. And I don't know what to do. Um, yeah, my castle is not great. To say the least. I think I just got overly anxious, and maybe it's something that I should be regretting. I don't know. I can't allow this token to exist right next to my king. Okay, that is actually a really powerful threat. Um... I think this adequately defends. I'm not... I don't have time to figure everything out. Um, hmm. Go hmm. Today's proverb is about putting your horse next to your king and the dragon next to the opposing king. And I have failed at this. Um, oh, this fork wins my horse, because uh, my king has nowhere to run. That's not good. Um, yeah, I saw this. I didn't think it led anywhere. All right, where's the super embarrassing checkmate that I just walked into? There's got to be one. It's just... Oh, there's a pawn drop right in front of my king. There it is. All right. Both of us missed it. Um, I'm in check. I must capture. Or resign. Okay, um, there's a silver drop mate threat. Hmm. Is that all? I think that's all. I don't think I have a mate in response to that.
Yeah, this is going to hurt. This is going to hurt as soon as we can start feeling pain. Oh, okay. Well, I missed that. Well spotted. Thanks for the game. Yeah. So, oh. Our DNS doesn't resolve once more, um, but we can see from my page whenever this loads um, that, yeah, our progress toward one Don is at 25%. That's just more or less where we've been for the last months, so it'll take us a while to get somewhere. At some point I do want to switch over and start... Oh, sorry. At some point I do want to switch over and start playing uh, again. On uh, the 10 second uh, category. Maybe that would help me think about my thoughts a bit more clearly, but maybe the counting is something I'd have to figure out how to uh, patiently experience. Um, either way, yeah, hope we enjoyed these games. Thanks for watching.